there. Okay, kind of shifts the gears today. And uh, this is back to uh, EJ Potter's project. And yeah, I told you, I don't know, a couple of days ago that I was going to I was going to make a stand for EJ Potter's pulling tractor and uh, to kind of make it look a little nicer to display instead of just sitting down on the, on the shelf. I thought we would uh, just um, build a little stand with some, some little signs on it and then we'll put some little lettering on it. I'll show you here real quick. I'm going to get this cleaned up just a little bit. I did was I built some mounting brackets and because of the taper on the stand it's, it'd be hard to lift up without having to maybe grab the tractor if you were going to move it around so I went ahead and built a couple little grab handles and I built this we might put some lettering down here with some little bit of information about EJ Potter and then we'll put maybe a double ugly decal right there and then I might put Michigan Madman up here and uh, that'll make it look really nice so I did what I did was I mounted a, a 3 8 bolt on the back with a nut with a nut partially on there so when I put the when I put the hitch on there the tractor I can lock them both down so it won't give either way and I don't have to tighten the tension down on the tires so it won't move I don't want to put tension on the axle. And then on the front one, I put a double. I drilled a hole and I welded a nut underneath the, the, the pulling tractor. So I just come up from underneath it and just turn it and tighten that on there. So, so that's how that will set there. So let me get the tractor and I'll show you how that's going to be. All right, here's EJ's tractor. It really hasn't done much. I haven't done much to it. There's not a whole lot to do yet, but I want to still take the tires off and I still want to do some sanding on the back and a little bit of sanding down in here. And uh, I got to clip the front axles yet. They're too long, so I'll kind of show you. Maybe when I set it down in here, how it's going to go. So if, you, if I set it right here, you can kind of see the back hitch. If I take this. I take this off and I'll put it right through the draw bar, like so. And I'll put the nut on there. And this one is going to adjust the nut on the bottom to take most of the pressure off the, the tires. Okay, so that's snug. And on my handles, how handy it is just to move it around. Then I got uh, my little mark, mark here. So I'm, this one goes in from underneath, so a little bit. Maybe a little bit of trial and error to try to line it up. Nope, went right in the first time, so that was good. Not too tight, but there. That'll be really nice to uh, move around. And I think that's going to look, that's going to make his tractor look classier. And that's what I wanted. I wanted to make it look nice. And even though we want the tractor to look like the tractor, mostly primer and my friend said that's what my friend used to go over there you know, with his dad, and his dad was really good friend with EJ, and he told us some told me some cool stories about it, and uh, so that was pretty cool. <clears throat> so I think that's about it to kind of give you an update. So, uh, anything else, Deb? You think of? Oh, we're supposed to get a snowstorm. And it's just starting to snow right now, just, yeah, it's kind of snowing pretty good. But we haven't really got anything yet, so it's hard to see what's going to happen here. So anyway, everybody, there's the, there's the stand, and I'll give that a nice coat of paint. A nice little bit of, maybe white or maybe just gray, nothing too fancy, but then we'll put some nice, put nice lettering on there, and so that'll be nice. So anyway, there, and there's the handle, so, so that'll give you a, just those of you who are wondering what was happening on it. 
I was kind of just not sure how I was going to make the stand and today I just said hey let's do it so I did it and this is what I come up with and I like it so uh, okay catch you later everybody thanks for all the nice comments